With wind chills below zero, spending just a few minutes in conditions like these can be dangerous. Now new at 10, 41 Action News reporter Dia Wall shows us just how quickly frostbite can set in. Uh, this is our what we call our bunker gear. Dan Stringfield is in his 17th year as an Overland Park firefighter. So I can actually step right out of my uniform boots, step into my bunker gear, and then I'm halfway there. Just this weekend, OPFD responded to a two alarm fire at the Greenbrier townhomes in these cold temperatures, so they know a thing or two about staying safe and warm. This is our insulating layer, and then there's also the vapor barrier, which keeps us, it helps keep us warm and stuff as well. We use this thermal camera to show the difference in body temperature. White means warm. The darker the color, the cooler the temperature. I put one hand into some ice water and look at the difference. You saw what happened to my hand after just 10 seconds in some ice water. Well, imagine what'll happen to me. If I spent a few minutes outside in below freezing temperatures. But when the kind of temperature we had today morning and with the wind chill the way had, it can be as much as about 30 minutes of exposure and you can have a really bad injury. Whether you're fighting a fire or battling the brutal cold, the same rules apply. To keep warm, obviously the goal is just to keep everything covered up. In Overland Park, Dia Wall, 41 Action News.